Brian Marks will lead up to Mafuz. Dima trying to come back into the dash zone. Well. Mafuz loses an edge. And the dash take back the other way. Here's Justin Barr. Tries to pull the inside. He does. A great save by Kinsella. The puck squirts free and play is halted. First big chance for the Dashers tonight. It was Justin Barr taking himself to the net. Matt Kinsella having to come up big there. Halfway through the first period. Now the Dashers are now on the power play for 58 seconds. Here's Dustin Henning. Full send it. A backhand shot. Here's a shot. They score! Lucas LaBelle. He finished off the penalty. And just like that, the Dashers lead 1 0. Ryan Stern along the board. Feeds it back to Oslinch. Joe Pace winds up at fires. And a great glove save by Kinsella. Wow, was that a great glove save? He had. Not a whole lot of vision. He was being screened by his own players. And he comes up with a great glove save. Uh, Danville does win the draw, though. It's Ray Tremblay. Tries to center. It does. It Barr tried to set in for a deflection. Andreev can't put it on goal, though. He does have it in the corner, though. Andreev. Right in front for Stern. He moves in. It scores! Ryan Stern! Oh, Dangle, Snipe, and Selly. What a play by Ryan Stern going right to the net. A great feat from Andreev. It's 2-0 Danville. Both goals on the power play. Here comes Justin Barr now. Tries to pull the center. He will shoot it. That goes just wide. Oh, and Kinsella goes down. Nick Williams ran to him. He's going to drop the gloves. Williams and Lyles are going to go. Williams gets hit a right. Both will get the shots in. Lyles gets a good right in. And down goes Williams. Malcolm Lyles doing it all. And then we'll get five minutes. The crowd here at the David S. Palmer Arena loving it so far. And as I really saw, the Dashers have shown up and are ready to roll here tonight. Across the blue line. Drops it off for Battaglia. Back to Mafuz in the corner. Tried to center. Good job there by Joe Pace to deflect the pass away. But Tim Riccio keeps it in. Back to Battaglia on the far side. Gets it to Mafuz. Let's it go. And he scores. Ahmed Mafuz has scored for the Demons. And they have put the uh, game back within a goal. Good set up there by Tim Riccio. Feeding the puck right to Ahmed Mafuz in the slot. And they are back within one. On the outside. Trying to pass it in front. And there to take the shot was Ryan Stern. But he couldn't put it home. Here's Huggett, a shot. The late penalty up, coming and they score! On the delay penalty. I didn't see who tipped that one in, but the Dashers have taken a 3-1 lead and are back up again by a deuce. So Shea holds up. Cross for Mafuz, lets it go. Great save by Semner. One of the demons went down to get Justin Barr that chance. Meanwhile, Riccio goes down to get a two-on-one. Tremblay shoots it off the post. Rebound score! Roman Andreev! He's got his second of the night. And it is 4-1 Danville. Aiken has it looking. Gets it to Mafuz along the boards. Mafuz looking, waiting, gets it back to Aiken at the top of the slot. Back to Mafuz at the hash marks. Gives it to Giuliano, tries to feed up front. Rebound, moves for Sepner. There's a shot by Marks, a shot by Mafuz, and he scores. Ahmed Mafuz as the second of the night at a tough angle. Is he caught Jeremy Sepner looking in the wrong direction? And Mafuz with both goals for Dayton in the second period, and it's once again a two goal game. Lead pass over. Here's Wade Darge, move again. Or rather, August Dakin. My apologies, had a good save there by Setner. That save by Setner. 55 seconds to go on the five on three. Marks has it. Beats it for Pataglia. Back to Marks. Shoots it and scores. It was only a matter of time. Brian Marks with the goal. And it's 4 3, just like that. Can only do so much when you're constantly taking penalties. And that one finally bites Danville. 
And this is once again a one goal game. Don't go away yet. Starting to Pelache come together. Mafus comes up with it. Lead pass for Pelish, uh, Pitaglia. Turned over. Oh, and that's a dangerous hit. Now is this uncalled for. Dangerous hit. And this is going to draw a fight. To go, that's going to go with Joe Pace. And rightfully so, Joe Pace sticking up for his teammate. Joe Pace getting in some lefts. Taguna getting in a good right there. Getting the jersey over the head of Joe Pace. Pace with the jersey over his head. Takes down Taguna. And that'll be all. So while the Dashers dominate the offense of the first period, the Demons have done a good job coming back to getting more shots on goal. And they have evened things up in terms of the shot totals while the Dashers still lead by a goal. LaBelle has it. Here's a shot deflected. Score! Ryan Stern has his second and it took a funny bounce off one of the defensemen. And the Dashers get a lucky break. They get their third power play goal of the night and they lead 5-3. to three. Here's Mafuz along the far side. Tries to chase it on the dump and chase. Takes a funny hop. What a save! What a save by Jeremy Sempner. Wow. That puck took a funny bounce off one of the stanchions on the glass. Sempner thought the puck was going the other way. And instead he realized in the last second that it wasn't and the puck was right on the other side. Reached across with the glove. What a glorious save. Lead pass for Aiken. He will charge his way through the neutral zone. Along the wing. That was sticked away from them. Now he's possibly a shorthanded rush here for Andreev. Pulls to the outside. One timer score! Justin Barr! Shorthanded goal! Oh, how do you do? Oh, and just like that, the Dashers just about put this one away. Shorthanded goal for Justin Barr. It is six to three. Lyle's lead pass for Barr, it's off his stick and all the way down, this will not go for icing. Fisher will come up with it with 2.08 to go. Lead pass for Felton. Felton comes up that he will slap it. Oh, and that hit the crossbar. Save and they score. They cash on the rebound, the first shot by Felton went up the crossbar and the loose puck on the rebound. Tapped in there and the Demons back within two with 2.01 to go in the third period. 30 seconds to go. Gives it to Dietrich, and he will ice it. My apologies, Lucas LaBelle will ice it for his second of the night, and that's going to do it. Seven to four, Dashers. Four seconds to go, and the corner goes, and that's going to do it. Seven to four, Danville is the final score. So the Dashers will have their fourth win of the season. Jeremy Sutton will be 3-1 and one on the year. So the Dashers will win the first battle of the weekend against the Demons. They have two more games against Dayton this weekend, tomorrow and Sunday night in Dayton.
Let's take you down to the ice with Easton and our number one player of tonight's contest. Thank you very much, Chuck. I'm down here with number eight, Ryan Stern of your Danville Dashers. And uh, Ryan, you had two goals tonight. What made you able to put the bucket for that so well? Uh, just a good job for my teammates, recognizing that I'm open. And uh, they've been finding me with the pucks, and I was lucky enough to bury a few of them. Great job tonight, Ryan. Thank you very much. Yep. Uh, now I have a uh, starting goalie for your Danville Dashers. Number 35, Jeremy Stepner. Thank you very much, that's number 35, you're starting. 